I'm Todd Falk, VP of Sales and Marketing with Camus Boats. Camus Boats was founded in 2018 by the legendary Earl Bentz. It's his newest boat company and to date his most innovative. Uh, we're standing in front of our 401cc, our largest boat in our fleet, also the newest. We have our 341cc as well as our two bay boats, the 26HB and 28HB. All right, we're in the cockpit of the 401cc. A couple of really nice features here. One, of course, the rear-facing mezzanine seating. Really comfortable, great spot to watch your baits or just to be cruising from. We've got 120-quart cooler beneath the bench. And then tackle storage located behind. Uh, keep all your gear in. Holders like crazy. Uh, also, access to an optional second station up top there. All right, plenty of rod holders and cup holders back here, as well as your rocket launchers uh, in our powder coated aluminum frame. And we also have access to an optional second station where you can walk right up and uh, get on top of the hard top. Across the transom here, we've got twin 45 gallon live wells, acrylic lids. These are plumbed with hooker uh, 2100 gallon per hour pumps and hooker sea chest. And then on either side of that, 25 gallons of storage, which could also be plumbed as live wells and even tuna tubes. All right, this boat also features our optional rear seating back here. And then also Sea Keeper 3, located right here in the floor. And then our bilge access right there, are nice and big, plenty of room. So we've got our fuel manifold system above deck here, so you never have to reach down into the bilge to switch fuel tanks. Another unique feature of this model is our dual dive doors. So we've got dive doors port and starboard, so you can board and dock on either side. It makes it really convenient. Uh, get on, on and off the boat at the dock or at the sandbar tied up next to your buddies. All right, we're up in the bow section now. We've got really comfortable chaise lounge seating, uh, five rod holders on each side for your rod storage, cup holders, of course, uh, about 75 gallons of storage below the chaise lounge, and then a 25 gallon cooler up front here that can also be plumbed as a live well. In the forward section, we've got our optional U-shaped seating with articulating backrest. Uh, so really, really comfortable place to lounge. Uh, this boat features all Sunbrella Horizon upholstery, so really comfortable, wears very well. Uh, and then of course, the JL Audio sound system uh, throughout the boat, great, great crisp sound and uh, as loud as you want it. All right, here's our uh, electrically actuated backrest here for forward lounge seating. Get just the right angle, get nice and comfortable. Makes for a great spot to catch some sun. All right, we're at the helm of the 401cc. We've got triple Garmin 8617s across here. We're gonna also do twin Garmin uh, 8622s. Uh, this boat's got, uh, of course, side imaging, down imaging, uh, radar, autopilot, uh, also features FLIR. Um, and then for power, we've got uh, triple 300 Mercury Verados, uh, push this boat to low 60s, and uh, of course, a very comfortable cruise at 40 or 45 miles an hour. All right, we've got uh, the Mercury Vessel View 7 gauge here, right in front of your helm pod. It's a boutique painted helm pod, goes along with our release marine chair package. The uh, Edison uh, carbon fiber steering wheel, and then Mercury's a new control system right here for those Verado 300s. All right, we've got our house and engine uh, main uh, cutoff and uh, ignition system here, as well as our, your full control panel for all the functions on the boat. All right, a couple other nice features up here. We've got 12 volt air conditioning. Keep it cool on those hot summer days behind the glass here. Uh, your FLIR joystick uh, for the FLIR camera, and of course, bow thruster, and then uh, glove box with USB ports uh, for charging cell phones and other accessories. All right. We've got uh, Release Marine helm chairs, uh, teak ladder back helm chairs on this boat. Really, really comfortable, uh, really nice, and of course, very pretty. Uh, flip up bolster as well as armrest. And then we also have those on the electric seat slide to get yourself nice and comfortable when you're out there cruising. 
we have three-sided glass enclosure on this boat to keep you nice and protected from the elements. We've got a vent on it to allow a little bit of airflow as well as a windshield wiper. Nice big oversized hard top on this boat to get uh, not only you at the helm out of the sun, but also your passengers. Great overhead electronics box here, VHF and autopilot controls, as well as a glove box on this side just to toss your gear in while you're out of the boat. All right, our hard top is full fiberglass and structural, so it's designed to for a second station or to get up on top. Handrails all the way around. Of course, lots of great lighting. We've got our outriggers mounted up there, um, as well as a, another uh, four jail audio speakers for the sound system. All right, inside the cabin here, we've got an enclosed head, a shower, a six and a half foot berth, as well as uh, a drawer, refrigerator, and a small galley area. Uh, air conditioned by that same 12 volt uh, air conditioning system that, that powers the helm. I have plenty of headroom down here in the cabin. I'm about 5'10". You can see there's, there's plenty of space here. Also have a, a hatch above for uh, light in here as well as a nice lighting package. And then uh, again that six and a half foot berth down below. All right, we can do Mercury, Yamaha, or Suzuki engine packages, twin, triple, or quad, up to 1,800 horsepower. This particular boat's got quad 300 Mercury Verados, really, really nice fuel-efficient package, uh, but can do up to, uh, again, 1,800 horsepower on this boat. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below for more amazing content.